now, friends. Beth with thimble hooks, and I went shopping again. Or we went shopping, I guess. I didn't go by myself. But I went to Joann's and another another hit at my Tuesday morning, which is my new favorite place to go find yarn. So let's see what I found. I'm gonna move this one aside for right now. But these I got on purpose. I went to go and see if there was much for clearance and I really didn't have a lot of clearance going on. So, oh well, I guess it's not quite clearance time. But I got this. Buttercream Angel Hair. I have never worked with this one, but I have a project in mind for it already that my daughter requested. So I just got one little skein of that, and it's really fuzzy. This is a five weight. Even though it's super fuzzy, but it still says it's a five weight. I can use a six and a half millimeter hook. It looks way fatter than that, but it's not. I've never worked with this before, but I'm really excited to see what happens with this one. I don't have any buttercream, so this is a new one for me. I'm really excited about it. And then these ones I also haven't worked with before. I've always wanted to, and of course they were on sale because all of the Lion Brand stuff was on sale. So I've got. Sorry, this one's called Pumpkin. Forgot about that. It's orange. But this uh, Lion Brand feels like butter. And it really does. It feels like butter. It's amazing. I got two rose pink two pale gray and two dusty pink okay they didn't really make those names very exciting but they say what they are for sure I got two of each I have a project in mind for this too you'll be seeing those soon let's see what this is this one says it's a four I believe in that I believe that's probably a four medium and I can use a four millimeter hook Okay. Normally, normally the fours that I get for mediums tell me that I can or that I should be using a five. So that's interesting. That's new for me. But I have a project in mind for the pink, two shades of pink and gray. So, like I did not already have enough projects in my queue, right? I have a long list in my notebook of ideas, and I still went and got some more. But I'm going to put those down. See what else I got couple of things that actually were on clearance can't go wrong with bright pink bright pink cotton yarn this is Rhea from Lion Brand they were on clearance dollar 47 each can't go wrong I could always do something with pink this is a four weight I still get to use and now this one says five and a half which is what I would think on on this cotton yarn this is Rhea I have never really worked with this one 85% cotton and 15 polyester so it's not a totally cotton but it feels just like the peaches and lily and all that stuff and bright pink my favorite so I'm excited by that and one lonely thing I got the remember these from before I got one of every color they had one orange one left so I'm gonna add this to my stash for when I make the big project I got one of every color of this uh, softball lion brand softball it's really fun it's all twisted. It's like there's a fat, a fat strand and then a really skinny one twisted around it. And it's just cute. And I got one of every color when they were on clearance before. I must have found one more in the back room. So now I have two orange ones, which would actually be quite helpful for the project that I have in mind. And now the most exciting thing, because I have been looking for this yarn forever. It's really hard to find in my part, in my neck of the woods. But this is just... Red Heart Super Saver Americana, American, Americana. But I have a great project in mind for this. I bought everything they had. They only had four. I'm hoping I can find some more because I have a cool project that I want to share with everyone very soon. Really excited to find that. I've been looking for skeins of that yarn forever. And of course, this is just a, a regular old Super Saver Red Heart. So it's a, it's a four weight. Wants me to use a five and a half millimeter hook, all the same stuff. But it's great, red, white, and blue, and has a little bit of grading in there. It's so much fun. But my that project, I am so excited about that project. I can't wait to share it with all of you. But then here I've got another. 
another day I hit Tuesday morning what a great place to find yarn if you have a Tuesday morning around I suggest you stop in because this is just fun they have so many things that I've never seen before that I've never worked with before I've never even never even seen them never even heard of them before so that's fun so let's get organized here the never-ending bag of yarn I love it it's so much fun all right put down bag number one okay here's bag number one we're gonna start this one is called Kaleidoscope and the name is Goldilocks. It doesn't really tell you much about what it is, but it's kind of an, a really pale olive green and a light blue kind of mixed together. Could be interesting. I really don't know what this is going to look like when, it, when I crochet it up. It's a five bulky. Looks a little heavier than a five to me. It actually looks more closer to a six, but okay. And it tells me it wants me to use a nine millimeter hook. Huh. Well, that leads me to believe that it really is more of a six than a five. But they want me to use a nine mil. So let's see what I've got. What, what, do, what I can come up with that. I got four of those. They only had four, but these are. How long are you? Two hundred three yards each. So I have eight hundred yards. I can do something cool with that. Let's see what I can come up with. I'm kind of excited. I love working with things I've never worked with before, and I don't know the kaleidoscope people, but it's super soft. I'm going to go with it. I will come up with something super fun. I know it. And I was really excited to find this too. It's this Premier. Everybody's seen Premier yarn. It's so soft. But this one is the anti-peeling. Um, it's plain pooling. It's ready to go. And they had three of them. So I can make, you can see the picture on there. I can make a big plaid something. And I love to pool. I haven't shown you any pooling yet, but I've got I've got to pooling that isn't just the norm on the regular ones on my uh, on my list of things to do and list of things to show. So this will be another one. I'm excited. They had three and they are it's a four weight five and a half millimeter hook and how long are you? How much do I get? Three hundred and sixty yards. That's a lot. These are big. So that's that's a that's a lot. I can do something nice with that too. So again, so excited. I love Tuesday morning. You just never know what you're gonna find. And again, I've never seen these before. They had several of these and I grabbed this color that's called Fun House. And it does look like a fun house. That's fun. Euro Baby Babe Jazz. Never heard of these people before. But it's really soft. Amazingly soft. It's a 55 poly, 45 acrylic, amazingly soft, and they say I can use five and a half millimeter hook. Well, I will go with that. There's a sticker over the top of it. Oh, it's a three. This is a three weight, but they still want me to use the five and a half millimeter hook. Okay. I don't think I need to go quite that high, but the colors in here are just fun. It's almost every little pastel color you can come up with. Don't know what I'm going to make. 356 yards in each one of them, so it's over a thousand yards again. We can come up with something cute. I'm excited. I love to design. That's what I do. So I'm really excited by those. And this one was really interesting. All of these, I got five of these. This was fun. Ella Ray. Ella Ray with amazing colors called Plaza Bella. These are just gorgeous colors in here. It's like every swirly color. There's a lot of deep reds and purples in here, but then there's a splash of green here and there. And some blue. It's just, it, I can't even imagine how beautiful this is going to be. And this one is, they're saying this is a two. A two, it's fine yarn. It does seem pretty fine, but not a whole lot finer than the one I just was holding. And that one was a three, so it seems about the same. It's a little fuzzy. 
and they want me to use a four and a half millimeter hook. Isn't that funny how that works? They just decided that a four and a half millimeter will work. I'll give it a try and see what I come up with, but I got five and they are 350 yards each. These are really long and I have five of them. That's a lot. I've got a lot. I'm going to make something super fun and share it with everyone as soon as I'm done. And I know I say that with all of my yarn, I have a lot of projects coming up. So this is going to be great. Let's get rid of that one. And here's bag number two from Tuesday morning. I love it. Oh, these are gorgeous. Look at that. Boom, boom, boom. These are just beautiful. And what is this one? Knitting Fever Painted Mist. Very cool. 8% wool, 34 acrylic, 58 modal. Okay. Aren't these beautiful? Every shade of blue that you can think of. What do they call this? Santorini. That sounds about right. An island. Looks like water. Isn't that just gorgeous? And it is amazingly soft. They say this is a two, and I should use a four and a half millimeter hook. Again, it seems thicker than a two to me. It seems more like a three, but it is fuzzy. I'm going to see what I can come up with. I'm hoping I'm going to be able to have enough to make a sweater. 273 yards each times five. Might be able to make myself a cardigan. I'm really excited by that. Gorgeous, gorgeous shades of blue. I just love these. Couldn't resist. And then also, for extra fun, just like it in pink. I love pink. Five in pink. So if I can make a sweater, then I'm going to get to have two sweaters. I'm so excited. Again, this is exactly the same. This is the Knitting Fever Painted Mist. And your color name, this one's called Ramblin' Rose. Every shade of pink you can come up with. Isn't that just fun? I just love this yarn. I don't know the Knitting Fever Painted Mist people, but I think they're going to be some of my new best friends. I'm really excited by that. And then, let's see what else I got in here. Oh yeah. Remember last time, from the Hook Nook Yummy. And what shade of pink are you? you just call it pink? Oh, the sticker's on it. Well, this is a five weight, 185 yards five weight and this is what I made my cat ears hat out of and I already had some of this now I have more I think I have six or seven so I'm gonna make something really big out of this one I'm sure I have enough with the five bulky and having five or six of these I'm sure I have enough that I can make a sweater or a super scarf or something awesome I'm so excited but again this is the hook nook yummy I found these before and they found some more for me so I thought that was great got three more of those and last but not least I love my Karen products I just love Karen everything they do is so soft and so nice Karen cakes they have four of these just waiting for me and these are really big these are really big what color are you this one is called rum raisin seems like I have another stash of rum raisin and if that's true I'm really excited seems like I have some rum raisin already so that means I just added to my stash and I can make something huge but again Karen your inspirations Karen cakes these ones are big this is a four medium use a five millimeter hook but this is 383 yards times four. That's a lot. That is so much. I'm so excited by this. But that was my tiny yarn haul. My tiny yarn haul just happened to stop by because you know my car only only goes to Joann's and, and uh, Hobby Lobby and 
Now it goes drives itself to Tuesday morning. And I love going to Tuesday morning because I never know what I'm going to find and I get to work with totally new products instead of going for my old, reliable, I love this product. I'm going to try something new and I can't wait to bring you new patterns and show you how, show you everything that I can come up with because I can't wait to dig in and start designing. So thanks for stopping by. Thanks for enjoying my yarn haul. I hope you're having much fun with this as I do. Um, thank you for supporting my small business. Please subscribe to my channel and stop back soon and see what I make out of all of my new fun stuff. Bye.